Hi everybody, Jessie here. Um, I got another project share for you. I used my Graphic 45 French Pottery stack and I made myself a recipe book. This paper pad just always screamed recipe book to me. It's not super embellished or anything because it's for practical use. I'm going to use it. I'm going to have it in my kitchen. So I just kept everything fairly simple. Um, I did completely devour like a 12 by 12, the 12 by 12 pad. This is what's left. There's two bigger sheets and everything else is fairly small. Um, I'll probably use it up on cards and things like that. So that's what's left. And I used, I think I used three or four sheets out of my eight by eight pad as well. The book itself measures 10 inches by seven and a half inches and my pages are nine and a half by seven. This is just one of the cutouts. I really like the sunflower. So I'm added it on black paper and popped it up. And this is just some hemp that I tied around it into a bow and a little bit of the chicken piece. And this is some flat back pearls that I got from a friend of mine over that we hang out with Ustream and Twitter, Susan Love Rubens, um, bought me the black and the white from Formosa Crafts. So I used that. And I have some more hemp tied on the back. So, and this is just the Martha Stewart um, Eyelet Lace Punch, just to decorate it up a little bit. The book itself, I think I have. That's my son running around. <laughs> the book itself, I think I have about 60 recipe cards in it right now. It'll hold about 100 all said and done. So the inside of the book, this is a pocket. So it was made with a paper bag. And I can slide just like recipes that I get that have to be transferred and things like that into here. So the first will hold two and it's just got like the little pocket here and I matted it with that. And then it folds open. And there's another little band here to tuck recipes and things like that. My grandma writes out on a piece of paper for me and things like that. And then in here we got two pockets. There's one there and one there and they'll each hold two recipe cards and all the pages are the same so I'm not going to go through it every time I'm just going to kind of flip through it after this so those all fit in there and then the back of it has nothing on it so I can do like a recipe of my grandma's handwriting or something really special there on all of them so and it just continues on like that so you can kind of see the paper I use to map them all out I really really like this pad but it did it always screamed that I needed to make a recipe book out of it because it's I don't know it just seemed ever so perfect so and it just carries on like that the whole way through you've got two pockets and then the inside of everyone and you've got the little belly band on this page so I'm just gonna run through it really quick because there's nothing uber fancy about it All right. Super simple and quick to put together. And the paper, it, it was just really, really pretty. I think it's gonna work fantastic in my kitchen. And these were printable. Um, I can't remember offhand who said I got them off of it. Just as recipe for the very simple I printed them out on craft card stock. If you want to know exactly where that free printable came from, see, I don't have them inside of here yet. Um. Just let me know and I will go into my files where I have it saved and tell you exactly who the principal came from. So that's it you guys, super simple. Uh, I think I put it together in about six hours. So that's it, thanks for watching, bye.